Alexandra Greenhill. I'm a physician by training and um, CEO and founder of uh, Care Team Technologies. In my 20 years in practice, I've witnessed many people have life-changing events, and I've walked with them through navigating the healthcare system, something you heard Dr. Biden describe as overwhelming, scary, and almost impossible to achieve without someone in your corner who understands how the system works. In the last 20 years, we've made amazing inroads in technology and innovation, but we've also complexified it all even further. And so this is data from the advisory board that calculated in 2017 the number of appointments, visit, medical events that happen inside a hospital, in an average U.S. hospital, to 17,000, in a clinic to 350,000, and in the community to 2.5 million, which if you are good in math would know is more than 99%. And that combination of different people, factors, systems, goals, activities, apps, and tools is supposed to magically come together and deliver better outcomes. It's like having an orchestra where everyone is very well-trained and well-intentioned, but they don't know what music they're playing and they don't know who the conductor is. And so we put together a team that's going to help navigate, patients navigate this and help you if you are a large healthcare organization, an insurance company, or a pharma company, put together all of the know-how that you have to the service of the patient so that they don't feel overwhelmed with navigating the, patient, uh, the, the healthcare system. Our team includes people with deep expertise in the four domains required to achieve this, clinical, business, technology and adoption, because we all know that adoption is where projects fail. What it does is, in a very simple way, combines four key elements. Who is involved on the healthcare side and on the patient side? What is the plan? Breaks down the plan into actionable sequence of actions, so appointments, tasks, and follow-ups, and ensures that somebody is there to help you deliver on that, and monitors whether it's getting applied or not. The literature shows that for every dollar you spend on care coordination, you get back anywhere from four to $21 back. And in clinical practice, I know it. The difference between a patient with cancer or stroke or heart failure is oftentimes, do they have someone in their family who shows up with a binder and says this is what they should do next? And do they have a team of people around them, a support network, that you heard Dr. Dean Ornish this morning talk about how important that is. And so we've created that tool and we are ready to uh, implement. The World Economic Forum picked us up as a new champion uh, this year. We're working with uh, 15 organizations, and we'd love to show you why you need to act now as healthcare is moving out of the hospital, and we need to create a new type of technology platform to support that. Thank you.